Hi students, coming to the next topic, this is a process assessment and improvement. So whatever the process uh, you're going to be, means the organization is going to be do, so they can have some assessments and improvements. So for that assessments and improvements, uh, they are having some, uh, that product will be allotted with some standards, standardization techniques. So let us see those uh, assessments. The first one is a standard CMMI assessment method for processes improvement. We call it as CSCAMPI. S means standard. C is CMMI, capability maturity model. A is assessment method process improvement. What this standard indicates? It provides a five step process assessment model that incorporates five phases initiating, diagnosing, establishing, acting and learning. If uh, that process is having, if the organization is dealing with some process, if that process is having this type, five phases assessments, that is initiating, diagnosing, establishing, acting and learning, then this, that process will be given some standard that is the SCAMPI standard that is a standard CMMI assessment method for process improvement and the next CMM based appraisal for internal process improvement we call it as CBAIPI CMM based appraisal for internal process improvement internal process improvement so what this standard is providing it provides a diagnostic technique for Assessing the relatively maturity of software organization. So that we uh, discussed about this, the SCI, CMM. That is a software engineering institution uh, developing one standard that is a capability maturity model. So if it is satisfying some internal process improvement, then they are giving this standard. Next, coming to the next process assessment, that is the SPICE the SPICE, this is one of the international organization for standardization, ISO, and this is the number they are given. It defines a set of requirements for software process assessment. The intent of the standard is to assist organization in developing an objective evaluation. So the main insist of uh, this standard was, it is going to be... Uh, assist organization in developing an objective evaluation of efficacy of any defined software so uh, any defined software process they are going to be assess some uh, objective evaluation so this spice will indicate if the process is having this type of evaluation then it will be given a standard like spice next standardization is iso 9001 that is or 2000 for software so, if your software is holding these standardization certificate, then it indicates it is a generic standard that applies to any organization that wants to improve overall quality of a product. If any organization is going to be improved some overall quality of a product, systems or services that it provides, then they are giving this ISO 9001 standard to that software. This standard directly applied to software organizations. So based on the usage and based on the evaluations and based on the requirements and the quality they are going to be provide, that software is going to be provided by that organization. For that, they are giving the standards. If the, if, uh, the product or the process or any software is following these five phases, then it indicates a standard uh, SC. AMPA will be given to that software if it provides an assessing the relatively maturity of uh, diagnosing technique if it is following the diagnostic technique then they are giving CBA IPA internal process improvement they are saying that your software is having internal process improvement and the spice the spice is given to for uh, developing an objective evaluation if the if software is providing some assistant organization developing objective evaluation then they are given the spice so and this standard is given to overall uh, based on the improvement uh, of overall quality of a product then they are given the standard to your software like iso 9001 to 2000 for software so this is about the process assessment and improvement thank you